Hi, Robin Nunziato. My friends and family call me Bobby. Born and raised in Staten Island, New York. Used to play co-ed softball for the Lime Green Machines in the outfield center fielder. November 10th, 2019, playoff game. First batter, hit the ball, fly ball between me and my friend in outfield, center field and left field. We had a turn and chased that ball down. We both ran as fast as we can. I ended up diving for the ball. So did my teammate, but he had to try to avoid me. When he jumped over me, when I dove for the ball, his knee hit me in the head by accident. And that's where the rest of the story goes. As Soon as the accident happened, my friends and family called an ambulance to come for the two of us. When they brought it there, they took an x-ray and see that my entire skull and my whole left side of my face was broken. They had to do an emergency surgery immediately to make sure that my acute subdural hematoma can be fixed. There's an x-ray of the skull before the surgery. My surgeon had told my, my mother and my wife that she had three options. One, she'll have to come back again. Two, she'll have to put a plate cover in the crack. Or three, she get to put it together like a puzzle. And luckily she did. This is what the family had to go through. This is a good view of the scam in my head. I was in the hospital for a total of six weeks. After two weeks that I was in a coma, I woke up. I was moved to a regular room. Could be in the hospital for a year for physical therapy. After a total of six weeks, I had gotten better to the point that God blessed me and said, you need to go home on Christmas. Here's the start of the scar. 108 staples going from here all the way to the bottom of my head, on my ear. And that was the surgeon needed to do to open my head. It's been about a little over a year now. Uh, I feel amazing. Uh, I could only, I could thank God, my friends, my family, that it was the most amazing surgery and most effectively the, the surgeon that was there that morning. Uh, I, could, I think every day about it. My life changed. And the last thing I'll say is everyone, please, please, worry about your life, enjoy it. Because you may never know when it may end. <laughs>